Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's me, Sir Jesse Chan Esner, CISO, a college instructor of Ramon Mathesai Memorial Colleges. For today's tutorial, I will teach you on how to import multiple choice exam using question bank. First thing to do is you need to open a new Microsoft Word. And then I have here an example of multiple choice exam. So we need to try these three items, copy and then paste it to the blank Microsoft Word. And then it is the right time for us to edit it according to the applicable format for question bank. So we need to edit it. So yung format pala ng question bank is kailangan yung first is the statement or the question. Then after that followed by the multiple choices from A, B, C, or D. And then make it sure na capital letter A, period, space, and the choices. Same with letter B, capital letter B, period, space, choices. Next, letter C, period, space, choices. The last one is D, period, space, then choices. Then after the letter D, we need to type capital letter lahat, answer, colon, space, and the correct answer without period. Then if you want to proceed to the next question, we need to give one space and then followed by the question number two. And please take note, we don't need to put number one, number two, or number three. So, same routine, same process with number one. So, for, for number two, statement, then the choices from A to D, and then answer, colon, space, and the correct answer. So, this would be the right format for importing a uh, multiple choice for question bank so ayan na edit na natin so we need to copy it and paste it to notepad so we need to open notepad application ayan and then paste it so this is the right one then we need to save so temporary i'm going to put in the desktop and then you need to put the file name and then save make it sure the encoding type is utf-8 save to do is we need to go to our open LMS click our subject which is the art appreciation and then go to our folder GE301 prelim 2021 and then let's go to the upper right button click the settings and then click question bank then after that we need to click first the categories and then we need to fill in the name I have here sample exam Cubank and then don't forget to click the pairing category which is you need to tap the GE301 and then add category after adding it is the right time for us to click the import click icon format and choose a file so we need to choose yung na-save natin na file sa notepad ayan o click open and then upload this file so after that you need to click import so naging successful walang red mark so let's 
proceed and then click continue. So, successful yung ginawa natin. So, ayan na siya. So, proceed tayo sa our subject again. And then, click this folder, yung prelim 2021, and then create learning activity. So, click quiz. So, upon clicking this, again, you need to fill in, but then you need to hide that from our students, and then you need to fill in the name, area. So, I have here, sample exam, and then you need to edit the timing. Change the date and click display but then you need to put the in the description box the instructions that you want. So let for example, please read and click save and display. So ayan, so we need to click edit quiz and then Click that portion, then click from question bank. So we need to wait. Then we need to select category. Click the top for GE301. And then we need to select those questions, three questions that we imported. Then click add selected question to the quiz. So ayan, we were able to put now the imported question sa ating exam so it is the right time for us to click this one if how many points yung ibigay natin every questions and then we need to click save so in order for us to determine if successful ba, we need to click this preview. So, ayan. This is the question number one. Then, you may select the right answer. Ayan. The last question is... There you go. So, finish attempt. So, ayan ma'am, naging successful po ang ating tutorial on how to import multiple choices type of exam using question bank. So, hopefully you've learned a lot from this tutorial and God bless po sa paggawa ng exam. Thank you and God bless.